Hey everyone, my name is Bryce Lennon and thanks for stopping by today. I took some time out of my busy schedule to give you a review of an avocado line from The Natural Club. The Natural Club was launched back in 2016 as a black owned business. At The Natural Club, they are committed to using cruelty free, vegan, and gluten free ingredients. In addition, they emphasize self love and encourage women of color to support and learn from each other. I got about six items that I can use in my hair today. First up, we have the Cleansing Avocado Shampoo. Gently massage through your wet hair and rinse thoroughly. Next, we're going to apply the Hydrating Avocado Conditioner, working through the roots. Make sure you detangle in sections, then rinse thoroughly. Here we have the Avocado Deep Conditioner, which is applied to wet hair. Comb through for an even distribution, cover hair, and let it sit for 20 to 40 minutes. Rinse thoroughly. Here we have the Nourishing Leave-In Conditioner. Gently comb through for an even distribution. Next up we have the Curl Custard for damp hair. Make sure you never apply this directly to your scalp. Can we say flaky? Last but not least, we have the Pure Avocado Oil for a glossy finale. There's nothing wrong with a little shine. Oh, now I mentioned before that this is an avocado line. So, here's my hair before I started using the first product, which is the Cleansing Avocado Shampoo. Be right back. Now, to be transparent, I don't really switch up my shampoo regimen, so I might be speaking from a place of ignorance, right? However, like I said, I liked it. The scent smelled good. It didn't actually smell like an avocado, but then again, I don't really know what avocados smell like since they have a scent to them. I know what they taste like. Duh. But whatever the case may be, like I previously mentioned, the shampoo smells good. So I'm about to rinse it out and be right back. Bravo, Natural Club. Bravo, bravo. I'm here for you all. I'm here for it. So after rinsing my hair from the shampoo, my hair smells amazing. It's still dripping. All the suds are gone. And now I'm ready. I'm ready to put in the hydrating conditioner. So I'll be right back. So the conditioner is finally in my hair. I'm just going to do a little finger detangle to make sure it all goes through, followed by a little rinsey rinse. And then I'm going to obviously show you the results from that. Now I didn't section my hair off because I just got a trim recently. And I think my hair is not as long as it was before. Duh. <laughs> Duh. And I'm actually going to use this detangle comb which I'll show you once I put in the deep conditioner after the rinse. So now I'm definitely ready to rinse my hair out and I'll be right back. So I'm back again and the rinse went really well. My hair still smells and looks amazing. Obviously it's dripping wet. And now I'm ready for the deep conditioner. Now the deep conditioner has been in my freezer for about two hours. I took it out, let it defrost for a bit, obviously before this video even started. And I'm gonna put it in my hair, come back, and we're going to detangle it together with the detangler brush. So be right back. So now that the deep conditioner is in, and it's been in for about, say like, I left it in for like 40 minutes. 
So I'm about to actually comb through it with my detangler brush. The link for this or the information for this is actually in the description box below. So just, just watch me detangle. So now my hair is completely detangled. Um, it was really weird because I got a little bit of the deep conditioner in my eye and it started to burn a little bit. So that was a little concerning as you saw when I was detangling my hair. So now I'm pretty much ready to rinse and I'm going to show you those results as well. So be right back. So, whoo. Now out of every single product I've tried, I hate to say, but that one was my least favorite. <laughs> it has a big bruise on him now. <laughs> Maybe I was just being a little greedy, but the size, I wanted a little bit more, you know? Also, like I said, when I was detangling my hair, it started to get a little, about a little burning sensation on my scalp. But nevertheless, it went away a little bit, but I've never experienced anything like that before, okay? So I'm actually about to go put in the leave-in conditioner, which I've been really looking forward to using. So I'll be right back. So now I have the leave-in conditioner in and I'm ready to kind of tease out my hair. So it's about to get a little big right now, especially on one side, the side opposite of the part. So my hair is teased out on one side, I'm really digging it. The conditioner itself really smelled nice. It was very thick, which I really appreciated. And now I'm about time, well it's about time for me to use the curl custard. So now I have the curl custard in the palm of my hand and I'm about to apply a generous amount to my hair. So you can see how evenly, how it's evenly distributed throughout my hair. And I really love how it smells. And the texture was really on the lighter side. I really enjoyed it. And now, last but not least, I'm ready to apply some of the oil to my hair. So I'll be right back. So I actually have the avocado oil in my hand and I'm about to apply a generous amount to my hair. So hold on. So the oil smelled good, felt good. Um, oil is already, you know, sticky a little bit. So I wasn't surprised that it was. And I think my hair is fully like moisturized the curls are popping now before we close out I just want to put in my side part and then we're going to do the before and after photos okay be right back so big shout out to the natural club for all these amazing avocado products my curls are flowing my side part is juicing I got my Frederick Douglass going on now I'm ready to hit these streets Seriously, I'm ready to actually go to bed because wash days are very time consuming and I'm very tired. So here's my hair before. You can see my curl definition is a little off. You know, like I've been running around all day. I've been really busy. My hair's just a little dry. And this is pre-shampoo. And now you can see the curls are really defined. The juices are going in the hair. The shine is there. So thank you, Natural. Thank you. I appreciate you. Can't you just see the difference? Like, the curl definition was amazing.
So, before I close out, make sure you check out the description box below for more information on everything we've covered so far in this video. Also, be sure to follow me on all social media platforms at Bryce Lennon. Be sure to check out my blog, brycelennon.com, for weekly updates. And I hope that you have a great day.